Dear friends, in this video, I am going to discuss how simple linear regression works in practice. Obviously, we cannot conclude in one video all the features of the analysis involved in the regression, simple linear regression model. So we are going to take maybe a couple of videos or more, maybe three, four videos and complete the whole theoretical framework using a simple but powerful example. Let's start. Simple linear regression, the short form SLR. We are going to discuss the modeling and we are taking an example. How simple linear regression works in practice, SLR, how it works in practice. Consider the following data that gives a revenue as a function of room occupancy in the context of revenue management in a hotel. Revenue is the target variable to be predicted and occupancy is the predictor variable. Revenue return in dollars, occupancy in percentage, and you can see the data, and there are one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. So twelve data points are there, as you can see. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. And uh, revenue is the dependent variable y. Percentage occupancy is the feature or predictor variable x. We should not straight away go and build a simple linear regression model without understanding the nature of the relationship. First of all, is the assumption linear form valid? That we will have to see. Therefore, the crucial step is to do what's called scatter plot. I consider scatter plot as the bedrock of simple linear regression. So revenue is the y variable on the y axis, percentage occupancy, the x variable on the x axis is taken, and the data points that you have seen in this is plotted. This is y, this is x. Now, the dots, the blue dots, the round shaped dots, one, two, three, all the 12 points, they are the actual y values. And we are superimposing the best equation possible, which is the estimated equation. And the computer software gives you, particularly in the Microsoft Excel, in the scatter plot, uh, draw the linear trend line, it just gives you that. This is the best linear fit possible. And it is based on the statistical principle of least squares, which we will see subsequently. But it is enough to assume the least square regression line is plotted here. In the very first thing, in the scatter plot, you have the magnificent facility in Microsoft Excel. So this line is y hat, which is b0 plus b1 x1. And this is the best fit. Obviously, y hat represents the dependent variable estimated for the revenue for a corresponding value of x1. Naturally, all the points are not exactly on the line. There are some differences. Only in the case of perfect linearity, all the points will be on the line. So you 
see a lot of points are very, very close to the line. A couple of them, one, two, are almost on the line. And therefore, it appears the linear relationship holds true. Also, you can see as x increases, y also increases. And what we see here, the relationship between y and x is measured by a simple linear correlation. And that in this case is 0 0.9581 that exists between revenue and the room occupancy. A very, very strong relationship. 95.81 percentage that of correlation that exists between y and x. Therefore, prima facie, the linear model assumes to be robust. Now, let's look at this gap. One point to this, I'm taking as an illustration here. From this dot to this a line, obviously this measures the difference between the Y value and the estimated value based on the line of best fit. As we told earlier, the dots are the actual Y values in the data set. This difference is error E equal to Y minus Y hat. Y hat is the estimated line. Y is the actual point. And the difference between the two in the perfect case will be zero. Obviously, it is not zero. Some error is there. But we have been able to capture the essence of simple linear regression by the powerful tool scatter plot, which is the first step which we will have to do in the simple linear regression. Subsequent analysis we will see in the forthcoming videos. Thank you very much for watching. We will see you soon.